My name is Nicholas McCarthy. I am the writer-director of a movie called Home, and I'm here at South by Southwest to premiere it, to world premiere it. Well, Home is a, is a real traditional horror movie. And, you know, here in Austin, I know there's a huge, long-standing history of, of genre and midnight films, and in particular in this section in South by Southwest. And uh, Home trades in all that stuff that you expect from a horror movie and suspense and shock, disturbing images. It's, uh, it's, it's horror with a capital H. So Home is a movie that uh, uh, fits into almost the opposite end of what you'd expect from found footage horror. It's the opposite of a found footage horror movie. It's uh, horror constructed in a, in a real kind of traditional sense. And, and what we were trying to achieve with the movie is that you never knew what direction it was going to go in. And uh, stylistically, that meant we had to be very careful about where we placed the camera. We had to be very careful about where uh, uh, we cut. And, um, you know, that's, that's the kind of world I come from as far as my favorite horror films, you know. Um, what, what are some of the... Some of my favorites? Yeah. Well, you know, I, I don't discriminate in the genre. I like all kinds of movies. And I like a lot of contemporary horror films. Um, the older ones, though, that I love are um, Eyes Without a Face, a French film from the 50s that I love. Uh, the Hammer Horror, uh, the, their Dracula, their version of Dracula, the original Frankenstein. Night of the Living Dead, the original, the original Dawn of the Dead, Texas Chainsaw Massacre. And then recently, um, the French film Inside is a, a huge, huge movie for me. And actually, those directors are here at the fest, so I'm really excited to meet them again. But um, all those movies uh, uh, really ap approach their, their subjects very soberly. And that's something that was important for me with this movie, is uh, to kind of have that chilly atmosphere that I think great horror movies have. Well, the whole process of making the feature film of The Pact was lightning quick. I had done this 10-minute short film, and then I was asked by these, these guys who financed movies uh, if I had a script. And I said yes, which was a lie. And I went and I wrote the script uh, for the pact in five weeks. And um, all of a sudden, you know, it was like two months later, we were making the film. Um, and that was a great blessing for that movie because we could get it made and there was a certain immediacy. But I wanted to take a little more time uh, with, this, with this one. Um, so right after I premiered the pact at Sundance, I went up to a cabin in the woods to write, an actual cabin in the woods, not an ironic, it wasn't a ironic cabin in the woods. And I just kind of thought about what was the movie that I, you know, what was a horror movie that I wanted to see that I felt like I hadn't necessarily seen before. And um, when I came back, um, I had the beginnings of what this movie was. So it was put into production not too many months later, but I had just a little more time with this one, you know, and um, that was that was important, you know, because this film is a little more careful than the pact. Gosh, what do I hope people take away from this film? Where I mean, like, I love horror because as a director, you kind of trade in these, you know, these these kind of emotions that that uh, you know that one associates with a horror movie: suspense, shock, surprise, disgust. Um, being creeped out, being disturbed. Um, the, idea it's, uh, the idea of taking an audience through all those feelings is, is a really gratifying thing. Um, I hope they love it, and I hope they are troubled by it. <laughs> and looking uh, beyond South by the, the plans for the film beyond here, do we know what's happening next, or is this, is no. this the, first, the first note of it? Well, it's, you know, yeah, this, this is... This is the premiere is, is the, the start of a journey which we, we know not where it goes.